Hey guys, Burbank51 here with some more Hell Spider gameplay. Uh, let's choose a weapon. Today we're going to choose Burning Claws. So or right now, I, I'm going to go through multiple, more than one, I'm sure, because I'm not sure if I emphasized this enough in my last video, but this game is really, really hard. Um, I remember the first time I picked up this game, it was a while ago. What? I have to... I really had a hard time even getting past the first Hell Spider. It's kind of a fighting him is kind of a uh, what's the term? A catch twenty two, because in this game you can't actually move backwards, you, and you actually have to in order to use your primary weapon, you actually have to face this guy head on, which makes it very difficult. See, as you can see here, there you could actually have to turn to dodge this guy's attacks um, makes it really really difficult to um, actually attack this guy because you have to more or less be facing him head on and you have to you know you have to turn it move left and right unlike uh, normal bullet hell games um, another thing is that this guy well as you'll probably see I'll show you with the next weapon you could probably get a better view you know, view of how it works, but he actually evolves to counter the weapons that you're using in the way that you're taking him down. Um, see now, see, uh, you know, all, all his attributes are getting a little bit stronger bit by bit, but if I had been using a, um, there's a weapon that uses, well, I'll show you in the next video. You'll, you'll see. Okay. But as you can see here, like right there, he has some attacks that make it really, really, really difficult to attack him head on. And I lost a life. I'm actually doing pretty good though. I only lost one life. Um, after every third battle, which I'm about to beat. Oh, okay. I'm about to approach that right now if I can beat this guy. Um, you actually get a chance to either upgrade your ship get an extra life or um, change your weapon and you know the first dozen times I played this I was like why in hell would you ever want to change your weapon and it is because you know he does truly evolve to counter the weapons they're using so well sometimes changing the weapon really is I'm out of time oh I beat him though is it it, it didn't count ah oh. but anyway like Sometimes using an alternate weapon, you know, change your weapons actually does feel like an upgrade because he, the, the hell spider will be prepared for the weapons that you're using. Oh, this is a good one. All right. These are the secret missiles. Um, what are these? The worms of anguish? I think is what they're called. All right. I took out one of his, one of his rockets there. So that should make it a little bit easier, but I could just go around this guy and use these things and I don't have to actually ha attack him head on makes a lot lot I'm dead how did I <sighs> okay I was just saying it makes it a lot easier but apparently just because just because it's easier doesn't mean that you're not gonna get killed for being careless and talking to a small YouTube audience where is he there he is and I'm not Sure, whoa, okay. That's one way to counter people going all around you. I'm not I'm not sure if I decided, even though I had this weapon equipped, just to use my primary weapon, if he would uh, evolve to counter me using my primary weapon as opposed to uh, my special weapon. Although, that would be nice, you know, pull a little bit of uh, deception on this guy. And then I would, uh, I could just upgrade my ship rather than, yeah, there we go. Rather than changing weapons and not have to worry about it. Okay. Alright. It's a little bit more hazardous getting close to this guy right now. Ooh. In these, uh, although these worms of anguish have, uh, are seeking, if you, you know, go out a little bit, 
I, I don't know if you could tell, but they have a limited range. They do seem pretty effective. Yeah, you can use these all you want, as fast as you want, but if you hold them, they're a lot more powerful. Whoa, okay. I can't let this guy kill me. I have 18 seconds left. Alright, I'm going in. I'm going in for the kill. If I run out of time... Oh. Alright, there we go. Yeah, if I run out of time, even though I have an extra life, I'm it's still game over. Alright, now I get a chance to power up my ship. Um, Let's see. I think I want to increase... Uh, hmm. Shield capacity. That definitely come come in handy. Shield recharge? Oh, all right. Okay, I guess that um that little rectangle in the corner there, that is your shield's recharge, and I guess you can recharge your shield. Something I forgot about, if you survive long enough. <laughs> and our music's a little bit different this time, too. It's kind of freaky, actually. Uh, uh. All right, take him out, take him out. Ah. There we go, there we go, there we go. Yeah, Hill Spider Triangle destroyed. All right. And he has a much larger range with these bombs here. What the? Okay, 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 I'm out of there. What the heck? Okay, I'm going to have to take out one of his legs there. Uh, uh, oh, okay. There's my life. I would almost recharge my shields, too. There we go. Whew. All right. And you see there, he has uh, low energy shields like my own there. Just protecting some of his inner legs. Let's take that out. It will recharge if I... There we go. All right. Um, maybe I should back off this guy for a little bit. I'll just try to hit him with my missiles. Oh, not only does it recharge, that uh, energy shield gets bigger and bigger if you let it. Oh man, oh man, that's too much. That's too much. And I'm dead, game over. Well anyway guys, um, I think I'll end the gameplay right here. Um, Transdimensional Hell Spider, uh, go challenge yourselves. Uh, it's a free game. Links will be in the description as always. Um, and don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more free indie games. I'm going to be doing more free gameplays. I really love these really, really hard, challenging games. So I'm going to be playing a lot more of these. Um, and of course, I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>